let's look at this problem on probability which is a conditional probability. Conditional probability happens when uh, one event is affected by the previous event. Okay, suppose if you roll a die, uh, say, and, and uh, if you roll a die the second time, and if someone is asking you what's the probability of getting six uh, in the second uh, row, the probability would not change uh, irrespective of the number of times the die has been rolled. Every time you roll a die, the probability would remain the same. But there are situations where probab probability of a subsequent event is dependent on the previous event. So let's read this question. Claudia works. Claudia, I think the pronunciation is Claudia. Okay, Claudia works in a women, women's clothing boutique. When a customer comes to the shop, there is a 0.15 chance that she will buy a top that is on sale. If the customer buys the top, Claudia offers a second one at a half price. 50% of the customers will then buy the second top. So the buying of second top is dependent on the first top. So the first question is draw a tree diagram. Okay, so this is a tree diagram. So this is the first top. This is the branches for the first top. So I'll write first top. Okay, first is enough. First top. The probability of a customer buying the first stop uh, when she comes to the shop is uh, so yeah this is buy buys okay doesn't okay so let me write does not does not buy okay the probability that the first stop is bought is 0 0.15 that means what's the probability of the customer not buying it. So this is 15%. So there's 85% that the customer would not buy. So this is 0 0.85. Once you buy the first stop, the second event, so let me draw the second branch. So this is the second branch. Here you will not get the second branch. So if you don't buy the first, you're not, you're not going to buy the second. So the second branch, this is the probably or this is the event of the customer buying the second uh, second top okay uh, if the customer buys the first top that means the first top Claudia will offer the second one at half price and that at a 50 percent of the customers buy so that means there's a probability of a customer to buy the second top is 0 0.5 so this is I'll write buy I'll write buy here buys and this branch does not buy does not so the probability of a customer not buying is again 50 percent 0.5 okay so now this is the two branches so this is this branch is dependent on this branch okay so you will not have the second uh, branch here because the customer hasn't bought uh, any top what is the probability that a customer will buy two tops? Okay, so this is this is what we are looking for. This is the branch we are looking for. Okay, that means the customer had bought the first top and then it buys the second top. So the probability or that the customer would buy the second top or buy two tops would be 0.15. That is the probability of a customer buying the first top times the probability of the customer buying the second top which is 0 0.5 okay so let's get the calculator out so this is my simple calculator so 0 0.15 this is a star key which is for times 0 0.5 okay which gives you 0 0.075 so the probability is 0 0.075 now just to make sense that means in terms of percentages, this means there is 7.5% probability that a customer will buy two tops. So if the question is, what's the probability of a, cust of a customer buying uh, the first top and not the second top, okay? Or the probability of buying only one top would be 0 0.15. Okay, so now the next is slightly complicated. So let's read the next question. 
Okay, if a customer buys two tops, Claudia offers to buy, to put her on a boutique's waiting list, sorry, mailing list, so that she is informed of future offers. 80% of the customers put their name on the list. So now, the next branch would be like this. Okay, so once you buy the second top, there is an option of uh, getting into the mailing list. So let me write the title here, the mailing list. Or let me write mailing only. So once you buy this second top, the branch would all only come here. This would be the, this, there will be no branch from here because this option of mailing is not offered to the person who buys only one top. Okay, so once you buy the second top, there's an option of being in the mailing list. And so say that, so let me write yes and no. Okay, so out of the people who bought the second, there are 80% who says yes to the mailing list. So this is 0 0.8 and this is 0 0.2. Okay, I hope this is clear. Okay, now let's read the question. 80% of the customers put their name on the list. That means 20% says no to the list. Okay, now we do. This is a very crucial sentence. If a customer comes into the boutique shop and buys one top. Okay, so that means we have to, we are looking only at this branch. We are not looking, we are not looking, we are only looking to the right of this branch. So, this is conditional probability. So you, the customer has bought one. Okay, so you're looking at only at this part of the uh, probability tree. So that is why this sentence is very important. The customer comes into the boutique shop and buys one top. Okay, that means you're uh, looking to the right of that branch. What is the probability that she will buy the second top, but not put a name on the mailing list? Okay, so that means you're looking from here, so she buys a top, but says no to the mailing list. So the probability would be 0 0.5 times 0 0.2. The probability that a customer bought the first, that means you have to look to the right. Okay, so it's not first, uh, buys the first top and the second top and says no. It is it is conditional that the customer has bought the first stop. That means you're looking to this branch. So the probability that the customer would buy the second top and say no to the mailing list is 0.5 times 0.2, which is, so let me get the calculator out. So let me cancel this. Uh, where is cancel? Yeah, so it's 0 0.5, 0 0.5 times 0 0.2, which is, 0.1, okay, that is 0.1, or there is 10%, this means there is 10% chance that the customer buy, who buys the second top would not say yes to the mailing list, okay.